take a look at this big sport fisherman. Don't know the size, but I'm guessing it's 40 plus, maybe 45 feet. You can see how big it is. Look way back there to the stern. You can see how big those propellers are, so you can guess or assume it's a pretty fast moving boat. But the thing I want to point out most here is this add-on bow thruster. So here we have an external bow thruster that's bolted into the bow of the boat. There's the propeller. You can see the bolting system there. A zinc goes right here. And I just don't know how well this boat or the bow thruster will handle crashing through waves at 20 knots or 25 knots. So if you're thinking about adding a bow thruster to your boat, typical people would actually have a professional bow thrust installer company drill a hole right through the boat in a 6, 8, 10 inch diameter, put a pipe, a tube, and the motor underneath the forward berth, run it either electrically or by hydraulic. It's rare that we see these external devices I've seen them in catalogs, occasionally I see them on boats, but I have not seen an external device on a sport fishing boat. Again, I'm concerned about the waves crashing up and down, working the bolting system loose. If you have any questions about bow thrusters, boats, diesel engines, propellers, or just shipyard maintenance, remember to ask Captain Chris.